Gamers, thank you for all the subs recently, and thank you to everyone joining the Discord. I'm going to try to make this a short video, because I just got a message on Discord asking where to put um, plugins in on FL Studio. I had a tutorial, and one of the plugins that I used was the Deep Blue Tape Stop. So quick, I'm going to show you guys how to download that, throw it in, and yeah. This is going to work with any plugin, so not just Deep Blue Tape Stop, but that's just the example that I'm going to use today. So go to the link and go to your download website. This says download Windows 32-bit. Uh, it doesn't matter, really. It just says that. So download this zip, and we can open this up. And we have a few things here. Now, if you want to get all of these, you most definitely can. But in the tutorial, the only thing that I use is this tape stop. So on your desktop, what you can do is you can just take this and you can drop it onto your desktop. And then you can close the zip. You don't need it anymore. If you want to grab the other plugins, feel free to do that. Just for the sake of organization, I'm going to right click on my desktop and make a new file called plugins. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this DLL file. You can see that it says .dll at the bottom and we're just gonna drop in our plugins folder. Now that we have that DLL file on our desktop and we know what folder it's in, what we can do is we can go to options and manage plugins. Now you might have not a lot of plugins here, maybe you do, but this little box is kind of what is important. This is where it's going to search for plugins. Now I have a bunch of different spots because I'm very disorganized, but really what you wanna do is you wanna hit this file with the plus button and it's gonna open up this window. Now ignore all my dumb files and look for the file that says plugins you might not see it right away so you might have to look around but it's going to be on your desktop if you did it how i did so just click on plugins and click ok this is going to add it to the bottom of your list it should be in yellow and then you can hit find plugins it's going to scan all the folders that you added and now it should be in here now like i said depending on how many plugins you have it might be a little hard to find but if it's brand new it's going to be highlighted in yellow so it highlights the most recent plugins in yellow i have two because i downloaded it twice now we can close it and we can open up our mixer and just for an example in our slot we can go to more plugins and then scroll until we find the yellow one deep blue tape stop right here and that is how you add it. If you guys need any help, you can join the Discord, always answering questions, or you can DM me directly on Discord or on Instagram or whatever you use, um, because I'm always happy to help. So yeah, thanks for watching, join the Discord, bye.